In this video I will show you how you can transform this photo into these glowing arms. If you are new to my channel and you want to learn photoshop, don't forget to subscribe and enable the ring bell button so you don't miss any new videos on photoshop. And don't forget to stick around until the end so you can see the whole process on creating this. Alright now a couple of things that we need to do here, I'm gonna remove this background because this area is a little bit too light there so you won't see it very good if you have this glow here. So I wanna make sure the background is dark so if I'll focus on the arms of this guy here and also get rid of the colors after that I can brush some areas lighter here on the arms and later on do some glow reflections on the body and some final adjustments to make it even better. So I'm gonna start off with getting rid of this background with a pen tool I'm gonna skip this fast forward so you don't have to watch this because it's really boring now once you got a selection make sure to press right mouse and select make selection and leave the pixel set 1 so we don't have a hard edge press ok and make a mask now let's start on working on this guy in the arms. So first I wanna create a solid color background here. I'm gonna go for dark gray so I can see this better and put it underneath this. So we have this gray background. Next I wanna press on the layer of him and let's create a hue and saturation layer here so we get rid of the colors. Make sure to press this so we only affect this layer underneath it. And let's get rid of some of the color. Now I wanna create a new layer here and select the brush go to the colors down here and let's select something yellowish a bit light yellow because I want to make this gold and gold's a little bit dark so we need to make it yellow first so let's start off with hold it down ctrl or command on mac and click on this guy here on the mask of it so we have this selection of it and now we can just start brushing you can make sure to have the flow and opacity 100% and just take a soft arm brush and start brushing these arms and when you come to this point you can make this smaller so it don't affect the body just brushing all these arms all the way yellow just make the brush smaller so you don't ruin the body itself but only the arms so now we got all this selection all this yellowish and the only thing we have to do here is change blend mode to overlay so this is gold already this is exactly what i want and now we can work on this gold so let's create a new layer here and this time i'm gonna select a little bit more to white and again hold down ctrl or command on mac and click on the mask of it and let's do a little bit more here because i want these parts more more glowing than outer parts and here we can also change the blend mode to overlay it's a little bit too much now so I'm gonna drop this to around 80-90% let's work on the reflections now I wanna make sure this glow is really reflecting on his body so let's create a new layer and again I'm gonna use this yellowish a little bit more yellow and change the blending mode here to overlay and make the brush smaller and let's create some reflections here Make sure the hardness is at zero. You can even drop the flow slightly here because it's a little bit too much now. And just work on this outer body. You can hold down control and select the mask of it so we don't go over this, over the edge of this body. Just these parts here. All right, this looks pretty good already. It's a little bit too much now as you can see. So I'm gonna drop the opacity here of it and let's say around 50% because we want still a focus on the arms and not on this body itself all right now we can work on the lighter and darker areas because this is way too light for this so i'm gonna go here and create a new girls layer i want to affect all the layers underneath it so i'm not gonna press this button just gonna go to the mid tones here make a dot and drag it to the middle so that way we are decreasing the mid tones here and we can slightly edit the highlights and just play around with this one so you get something that you like because this is really different for every photo if you have a different photo you need to make this maybe a little bit different than mine so this looks pretty good already make this even darker like that now let's create a new layer so we can get this really glowing 
and make sure to select this yellowish color again and let's drop the flow here to say around 30% and just make like this drawing around it so this is our glow and we can change the blending mode to soft light so it won't be too much just a little bit blow and if you want it more just duplicate the layer like that and if it's too much you can drop the opacity add some fire to his arms and some sparkles to make this even more powerful so i got this from the stock website you can check the link in the description you can download this and let's put it above all the other layers convert it to smart object and resize this to make sure it's like coming from his arms so change blend mode to screen here and resize this till you get a nice place so something like that and let's also duplicate this dragging it here or press ctrl command j and a little bit here let's make a mask here and make sure you don't see the end here first you want to press on this layer of it and press ctrl command l to bring up the levels so we can get rid of these parts here and just select the black picker and click there so that's gone and let's do the same here Ctrl command L, black picker and press here but that was too much just a little bit less like that and make a mask again and get rid of these parts here because I don't want to see where it ends just want to have it like on his arms and a little bit less here let's also get rid of this part let's do some final adjustments here let's make some shadows for its feet so for shadows I'm gonna create a new layer and bring the flow and opacity all the way down and just take a normal soft round brush and brush a couple of times here behind his feet and behind his feet so this looks a little bit more real then without shadows just a little detail Right, I got this as a background, so I'm gonna copy this and put this here and convert smart object and make sure to put it behind all the layers. And let's put this here. So this is like our wall behind it. Oh, a wall like that. And let's also make a floor, so I'm gonna duplicate this and drag it here. And stretch it out like that. So that's our floor surface. All right, we can add some reflections to this. So I'm gonna create a new layer here and put it above the background. And let's do some yellowish. Just take a normal brush. Bring the opacity and flow up again. And let's make some lighter areas behind it. And just change the blend mode to overlay or soft light whatever you like And some final adjustments like the colors so let's create the curves here and let's bring up the highlights slightly and drop the mid-tones like that let's do some red here green and blue and now we could do some color balance here get more red in it and some blue so yeah, that is basically it for this one. So thank you so much for watching. Hope you like my videos. And if you do, don't forget to subscribe and like this video. And see you in the next one.